Seamus, can you check out this battery holder for me? Make sure it's going to be okay for the project. Yeah? Good? Okay, it's approved by Seamus. Hey, how's it going? We're here in the Dino Fab Lab today doing more crazy stuff. Um, I'm making another 555 project while Seamus investigates things on the bench. And um, this thing is crazy. I call it the Light Controlled Screamer. You'll see why in a minute. It's a 555 circuit with two A-stable oscillators. This one drives the screaming speaker and this one drives a blinking LED. And then there's photoelectric cells that uh, are involved. Oh boy. And so here's the board I made. Kind of a hacked together thing on perf board. And it was sort of a experiment as you go type project where I was just changing values of resistors till I liked what I got because this is going to be entered in the artsy end of the 555 contest so I get a little leeway here with creativity but there they are the two a stable circuits the one to the left drives that little cell phone speaker and the one to the right drives that blinking LED on his nose and uh, let me get this thing powered up and you can see how it works these two will uh, change the frequency of the speaker when I'm blocking light from it and the one on his mouth will change the blink rate of the LED and some of that light from the LED will reflect off my hand and you'll see how it changes the sound that comes into play there. Okay, here we go. Let's get obnoxious with some sound. Oh, he's angry. There it is. Totally obnoxious and worthless and so much fun to build. But that's the deal with the, uh, the art entries. They really don't have to do anything but be fun and artsy, so... There it is, fun and artsy. What do you think, Seamus? He doesn't really care. Um, okay, now i got to cram all this stuff inside this head and get a battery in this body and figure out some way to put a switch on it so we can turn the damn thing off. Well, it's all crammed in there. Crammed into the head. And this would be the spinal cord uh, running into the body. Yeah, and then I've got a little uh, micro switch on the foot, and that's off from a Roomba robot. Lots of salvageable parts in those things. Uh, there's another video all about that. So um, there we go. Let's get this thing put together so you can uh, see it work. Let's put the head on the body. Gotta stuff this battery up inside here somewhere. This is just three, um, what are they, CR2032s, I think, three volts each taped together uh, with a couple of flat blade connectors stuck on there and some good old electrical tape to hold it all together. And I've got uh, what's left of the bottom here. I think this will kind of fit in there and hold it in place. Yep. Here we go. Well, here it is. It's going to come to life for the first time right before your very eyes. Right now. <laughs> Boy, he doesn't like to be covered up. Cool. I really think everybody should build one of these. Totally annoying for the office place. He's a pretty cool little guy. These money dolls are available at, like, uh, oh, they get them at hobby shops. Some art stores carry them. And um, they're kind of fun. They come in about three different sizes. I want to make one sometime, a bigger one, with uh, some sensors in it that does some goofy things when people get near it. I think that would be a lot of fun. So, there it is. The screamer. And as it gets toward the light, the pitch gets a lot higher. 
play music on this thing. See if I can play happy birthday. <laughs> no. Okay, never mind that. Anyway, build one of these. Go to the projects page and check it out. What do you think, Seamus? No, he's just going to cruise on by. All right, have fun. Visit the Dino Fab page for more projects. Hey, don't forget to check out the 555 contest at www. 555contest.com Enter and win some cool prizes.